Howdy, y'all. Hopefully you can hear me. I tried turning the sound down because I, I listened to myself yesterday and it was like it, it was like on overdrive or something. I think it's been like that a few days and I apologize. But uh, I'm going to try turning the sound down a little bit. Um, and I have this quote back because um, I was wrong about it. It uh, what ha- I've, I checked it. I, I looked at it afterwards. I uh, after I. Uh, got out of that video and I uh, got my little straight edge out and I checked the neck and I was like, holy mackerel. So the neck was super out of whack and uh, I had to hit the truss rod on it. Um, but after I did that, I was able to then be able to adjust the string height and, uh, you know, got lots more, got a lot more play out of there. So I was able to adjust it to where it's now super playable. I <laughs> I also um, had to lower the um, pickups just because, uh, you know, that's what you do. Anyways, I, I wanted to try and get a song out here, but I'm just not sure what, I, what to play because I have been trying to learn new songs every day. Um, if you don't, if you've been following along and didn't really notice or I hadn't said anything, Basically, um, what I try and do to this is for my mind because, like I said, with the chemotherapy and everything, I I want to be able to have my mind try to work on things every day, and that's one of the things that I've been trying to do is just kind of learn uh, at least part of a new song every day. Um, and I, I started to today; it's just not going to work on this guitar. So. Uh, <laughs> Anyway, anyways, uh, that won't work, so I, I am a seventies, eighties kid, so you know, um. I say you stand by the old man. Tell him something you don't understand. Yeah, you know. And that, 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 I mean, if y'all want to know, uh, this, this right here, the, the, this, this configuration right here is kind of, I've been running into this a lot because, you know, and then, uh, That's from um, White Snake. And I just realized that me, um, I've been trying to play uh, a song that kids today will have absolutely no idea what I mean. Mercury Blues. Um, used to be a car. Uh-huh. <laughs> I can't get the the rhythm, but um. I have my money. Tell 
I'm just having fun now. All I wanted to do is just let you know that this thing was actually imminently fixable. Oh, I'm sorry. If we can get the commercial out of the way, if you could like, comment, subscribe, that would be awesome. I'm looking to get to a thousand subscribers and then I want to give away a guitar. That's the commercial. That's it. Okay. So, um, but, uh, this is also, you know, uh, this is one of the things where when I started this channel, it was kind of for this. This is kind of what I wanted to do. Work on guitars, fix them up. And it's like when I like seriously, when my when my brain exploded, I was I was a computer technician and it just literally said, be a guitar technician. That's what my brain said. And it kind of it worked. I mean, because I started learning about how guitars are put together and how they're made and, and all that other stuff. And it just helped me out so much with um, setting them up because then I started to be able to set them up and I'm like, oh, wow, is this the way I set them up or am I getting better at playing? Because it was almost like, wow, this one plays itself, you know? Um, but I, I, at the time, I don't think I had been getting better. So now I think I'm getting slightly better as a guitar player, but at the time I wasn't. It was all, I, I'm pretty sure it was all that I just learned how to set up guitars. And, you know, it's kind of like when I was in IT and, and I would either bring a computer back from the dead or, you know, build one from, from parts and, you know, put it together. And the first time you started up, I was serious. It's like I'm in, in Frankenstein, the movie Frankenstein. It's, it's alive! It's alive! And I, I kind of feel the same way with these, you know. And when I when I do good on them, and, and it's like they're they're super playable. It's like wow, that's cool, you know. So, this one still needs a little bit more work because um, while the neck was messed up, I, I went to uh, look to see if it, if the you know everything was level, and yeah, it was. There's only one problem. I did a couple of bands. I don't know if you can hear that, but there's all sorts of scratchies in there. So I gotta get, I gotta loosen the strings up on this thing and at least polish them up and, or something. You know, I'll probably hit. Hit it with the crown or two real quick just to just to make sure. But um, yeah, I think it just needs a little polish and it should be way better than it was before. And that's kind of stuff I love doing, man, because it's like my little zen place. Because I don't have a job anymore. So it's like, you know, I, I need to do something with my hands all day. I don't know about y'all. But I need to do something with my hands. So I'm working on guitars. It's a godsend. And I have noticed one thing that uh, when you are doing repair work or maintenance work or setting up a guitar, you play differently. You play snippets instead of whole songs. You know, so I'm complaining about that, but it's like, you know, that, that is like one of the things that is great. Because then you can, you know, you can hear, these are songs that, that I played over and over on multiple guitars, multiple, you know, output sources. So um, you're going to hear the differences. And uh, yeah, so snippets. Anyways, I hope you all is having a great day. Always look up. He's there for you. And I'll see you then. Peace.